Right, so I've cleared a lot of bins and buckets. And, um... I've got a couple of clean buckets down here. And it looks like, well I thought actually, that this is the last bit of body parts to go. And then we've got endless tons of glass. But at least it doesn't make a mess. You know, glass is what we put in the bins. And I just spotted something else. I'll show you in a minute. Let me just clear up the last of these organy bits. And I'll show you something a bit naughty. But it might not be so bad. Otherwise, no, no point mopping that. Look. There's an arm up there, look. How did that arm get stuck up there? How do you reckon I can get that down? Do you reckon I can hit it? Oh, that was quite easy. I was quite worried that that was going to be a real pain to do. Let's get the bucket. Can I wait for Prince? Right. As long as I can jump up high enough to wash the ceiling. That was a bit sneaky, wasn't it? I think you'll agree. I'm hiding that hole up there. Oh, so I think this room is nearly done as far as organics. What I need to do, I need to go through, as I say, put all the glass up. And lug it down the corridor. Although the good thing is that I've also left lots of glass down the corridor. means I can sort of pick that up as I go. Okay, that as well. I think there's a main part of this level. Which done. A good splash. A bit splash happy in here to make sure that Hmm. So I think I might start putting some glass in here now. I guess you can't remember what a pain it is. It's... Where's the... That, that bit, that, that's the problem one. You know in names like Tetris and things like that, there's always one... There's always one piece that's more difficult than all the others to deal with. What in here is that one. These are all fine. This goes in here fine, slides in there. That, the V shape, I think, just gets it hooked on. Oh, for goodness sake. Hooked on other pieces of glass. Doesn't want to go in the bin properly. This is the glass equivalent of legs, as far as I'm concerned. Does not like what to operate. Come on, one, must, one more must go in there. You, look, you just don't want to... Mm, never mind. Right. Plug it back. And all the glass. See that? Let's see if I can do it again. Better come. No. I can pick it up a particular way around. Hold on. If I hold it like that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Here's a plan. I thought that being dense before. Look at this. Ah, glass. I have you. Stupid. It was fine before. That's a bit awkward. But yeah, but all that it was pointing down. So that's what I need to remember is how to pick up the glass. It does need careful handling after all. Come on. I mean, you, you pretty realise this ages ago, being far better than I am, but it's taken me a while to 
Well, that's the best way to do with glass. It's just really weird the way it interacts with itself. Look, it just doesn't want to behave, does it? And it's this big flat one in here. Look, oh, it's just stupid. Come on. It's just quicker to get another bin. I will persevere for now. I think also to always approach the bin from the same side probably helps. That way all the glass... Ah, oh, fine, whatever. ...lays flat. That's dead, look at that bit. <laughs> look at that bit of glass sticking out. Still working. So I only approach the bin from this side, and that way the glass all lies flat. Looking good. Faff, but you know. Oh no, come on. Really? That little bit of glass. Okay, let's try the old writing technique. Nope. Oh, come on! This has got a metal bottom on this... on this bin. How is that not... giving enough... weight to, uh... Make it right itself. <laughs> what a pest. A small piece, not you. Oh, not a small piece. Really annoying me this. So, barring some accidents with organs being dispensed from the bin, the bin dispenser, dispensed from the bin dispenser, I think this is probably last major piece of work. We're going to have to do it here. Which is good news, I'm sure you'll agree. Are we done, are we done here? So look, that's clear. So one more piece of glass here, wasn't there? No? Oh yes, there is, like I said. That's clear. Oh! Yeah, no, no, there's two there. Okay, fair enough. Right, now then we'll go down the corridor, clear the corridor, and finally get back to some normal body part moving and smopping, because, um, don't get me wrong, glass is probably fractionally easy to deal with than, uh, and organs, but not by very much. Okay, good, you'll do. There's quite a few bits down this corridor still, unfortunately. Probably at least one more bin's worth. I should get the light down here. I thought I'd now have dropped lost an organ or something down the side. And Until later. Yeah, we're gonna need another thing for this. All these damn bits here look. Most awkward orientations. 
mean, if you were a, you were clearing up a piece of glass this big, I hope you never have to, but you know, if you had to, which way, uh, which way would be the ideal orientation for you? I think you'd want to put it point down, wouldn't you? Point down in the bin. Not widest part first. Or maybe you would, I don't know. Doesn't seem very logical to me. Right, I think the end is in almost in sight for cryo. Finally, we have the locked door over there. And I've put the two data pads up here to see if either of those contains a clue about how we're gonna open that. And we've got a Work our way back towards the the entrance. And we first came in through a whole lot of bodies, but oh, stop it! There shouldn't be any large alien. I think I've cleared up all the large alien bits now. Get in the bit. Get in the bit. Get the bit. So the glass what he put in there was in trouble. So yeah, I have um. Oh, look at you lot! Look at you wriggling around in there. So yeah, I think we're pretty close now. So, like I said before, this, this level was a bit more complicated than I expected. How did you get out? But... I think we're good. A bit more work. No, you just stay in there, you lot. Oh, I don't really like the level, by the way. Um, This was still open. Because I'd left it, because I like to leave it open, so I'd need to put stuff in there. That's interesting. Sort of, isn't it? I'm pretty sure before that we learned the level, an open furnace would become a closed furnace. Maybe it was a fix um, associated with uh, trying to avoid bins of rubbish and doing weird things. I'm just guessing, speculating. Speculating wildly, as I'm going to. So there's there a bit of a gap since my last session. I've been off doing things, been a very busy week. And I've been driving all over the place. All over the UK I'm going. Well, not all over, but quite a lot. Quite a lot of places. So unfortunately I've not done as much as I'd like. I'd like to have this one completed by now, but never mind. There you go. Isn't it terrible when your life gets in the way of your hobby? <laughs> your job actually earns you the money and lets you do your job. Lets you do your hobby. It's so frustrating when that gets in the way. Oh, how did that happen? Huh? I'm sure I didn't bump it that hard. I don't know how much of a horror story is lying through that door. Okay, once I've unlocked it, it could be a whole massive new section, which goes to nowhere near finished. I don't know how many sneaky bits might be lurking. Yeah, well, there you go. There's something for a start. I didn't notice how many sneaky organs and things might be uh, lurking around, stuck in ceilings. So much hunting it might take me to find everything. Some. Oh, so. oh, 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 oh. Yeah, you're going straight in there. You're too big to mess around with. I couldn't even see what you were. I think you were a torso with a backpack missing the uh, missing the limbs. Must be the head. I don't know, and I don't do anything. I don't really care. How did that glass get down there? There you go. And an organ. Everything's falling out of the box. Is that everything? Not a big mess up there? I think so. There's a bit of pipe work. Pipe work in the pipe work.
thing here is we're now next to the next to the bucket dispenser. Hey look, I got it wrong. I didn't say bin dispenser. I meant bucket dispenser. We're near the bucket dispenser. So getting more water is, is easy enough. Oh, oh, oh! I yeah. That was stupid. I thought I was going to be ah, I thought I was gonna be letting go of that head. And in fact I didn't let go of it. I simply um, flicked it around and then dragged the bin over. Yeah, so it's easy to get buckets of water, but the uh, it's a bit of a trek to go to the bin dispenser. But you know, I can't cut those bits out. All the unnecessary running to and fro to get to get more bins. And mostly I do have another light. Mostly well, that was weird. What was that? Can you see that? I've got like a flashing edge of my screen. Is that from up there? That light's up there. It's a very weird effect. Um, I was going to say... Um, right. Very good. Yeah, mostly we won't have to cut over. I have to... Um, oh, that's not going to work, is it? We're not going to have to track over our own... through the mess too much, we'll just be progressing forward, section by section, don't have to run through big big loads of mess every time, and uh, to mop up after ourselves. There is unfortunately more glass up here though, I'm, I am uh, really growing to hate glass. Faffing around, orientating it, and it just seems to take up a lot of bin, a lot of bin room for what it is. What can you do? Not a lot. Is that clear? Mostly. Still getting some uh, screen tearing. Not quite sure what that is. I'll have to investigate that later. It's a bit frustrating. I'd have thought I wouldn't be having. Where is that factor of my. Um, oh, come on! It's just a problem with my. my recording. I don't know. As long as you want. It isn't too distracting. And I have been thinking what I can do next to upgrade my... my PC. It doesn't really need it, I don't think. Just to... If I want to do more recording like this, maybe I should. I mean, look at that. But I, I don't, I don't really. Uh, although I'm slightly tech savvy, I know how to do things like replace uh, components and all that sort of stuff. How to allow for increased power usage and cooling and all, you know, all that shenanigans. I can do that, but I'm not enough of a, a techie type person to keep up with what the latest cards are and what I should be getting. To look some guides up online, I think, to know, make sure I know what I'm doing. Don't need any more RAM. Got loads of that. It's more just the cards, I think, if I can get a... Uh, a better graphics card. Let's see if that can improve it. Yeah, at all. Yeah, I'm sure you don't want to hear about technical discussion. Though. Well, some of you might do. Do. I'm not the person to be talking about it. I'm not knowledgeable enough. Not my heart. Am I? No, I'm not. Am I? No. Have you got a face in there? I can't remember if I looked at you before. If there's actually a face to see in there or not. I don't think there is, is there? No. No, your mask is a bit too opaque. There you go. Ah, oh, blood on the ceilings again. I don't think there's anything lurking up there. I don't think there is, is there? No, it's not an it's not a sufficiently. It's 
enough for shelf to buy anything. And I'm interested by these boxes. If they are uh, hiding any horrors. Or if. No. Is there an indication that something's going to be high up for me to find? No. Okay. Horrible place to, to, to work all the time. I mean, we read the, the data pad from Mr. Vanilla Ice Fan. Like he's going slowly nuts. He was probably short for you, uh. Short of you, what? What did I ever say, though? I don't know. I don't know. I was just uh, he had a few screws loose, I think, before he started. So I was trying to infer around it. I wonder what I was thinking about saying there. Did I have something in mind? Just rambling wildly, or did some part of my brain I think it knew how it was going to finish that sentence? Never know. the last little bit of corridor it goes in a in a loop around here and there's some glass and some poor soldier has been dragged by the look of it and that's some other idiot's footprints where he runs into the level every time he reloads it um, but yeah we're getting pretty pretty close to it now Definitely not regretting the whole decision to keep the keep the highlights on. The object highlights has helped a great deal. Where's the bucket? I don't want a bucket over. Okay. And then, oh, glass. Well, we're going to leave that. We'll do what we did last time. glass to the end. doesn't matter if we hit glass, it's not going to make a mess or break into smaller pieces. If only if it broke into smaller pieces, it'd be easier to deal with. Okay. It's a spin that don't you, Chef? Sure? Guns collected. In an attempt to get achieved that probably isn't going to happen. That's where we come in. What does that say up there? Sector F. Yeah, I'm not very happy with the contrast on the writing in this. Uh, this looks it's very hard to read. I find it very hard to read some of the um, data pads that are over there. Right, uh, legs. Great nemesis legs. Just just behave yourself a little bit, okay? I'm going to carry you all the way around here, back to the furnace where you belong. Uh, you had to slap against the wall at some point, didn't you? Fine. We'll just take another bucket with us while we're there. We're going to need it, you know. Oh. Efficient with that slap I did. Can't see it. Oh, it's against the. Here it is, look. Against the door on the way through. One more light? Sure. Don't limit how many lights we can have. Missed a bit. We missed an alien. That's going to drag on the floor all the way through, I'm sure. Sling it in. Man, 
There you go. High speed mopping. Oh god. I overextended it myself, didn't I? Alien goop. Bad dead as when they are alive. A slight exaggeration. Flippant thing to say, I've not had to, to try and kill them. I've been consumed, I've been half consumed by them. These poor souls. I'm excited by that door though. There's a little puzzle. It's a puzzle they need to work out. I've got a good idea of how to get to that door. I've got a, I've got a, yeah, I think I'm fairly certain. But the devs are never that, never that mean. So far. Not been that mean so far in, uh, in their puzzles. So I think I know what they're gonna want. We'll see. Where's my bin? You're a bucket, I don't want you. Have you later? There it is. Do enough room for all this junk in. A very respectful way to refer to impo former employees. You know. Oh, it's something. Oh, look, I just realised that. There's scroll. Oh, look at this. There is scroll on the wall. Now we're gonna have to be careful here. If that scroll is a code for the door, I, I didn't think it would be on the wall. I thought it would be on the data pads. Uh, what I was thinking was, here's my here's my thought process processes process that uh, was going through my little head, which is that who do we know who works down here? Because the people that work down here are the ones that know the codes to get through the doors. And Mr. Vanilla Ice Obsessive, he worked down here. He comments the fact that he's stuck down here forever. And the Vanilla Ice is the only thing that gets him through. So I thought maybe um, one of the dates. Usually it's a, I think it's a four digit code for doors. I thought maybe one of the dates of a significant date to do a Vanilla Ice might be the code for the door. However, I haven't looked at it yet. Maybe what's been scrawled on the wall here is the code we need. And I was worried about that because um, I said before that just a sip my coffee if it was scrawled on the wall somewhere and I accidentally washed it off, well I'd be stuffed I wouldn't be able to get through the door, would I? What I can, it says, what's it say? It says door there D O O R and something else. And I can see 084666. Can you see that? I think that's what it is. Oh, that's the clearest one. 084666. Should we just try this now? Satisfy our curiosity. Because I'm sure you're curious too. 